Hello friends, today I'll share how to make pattern for short shrug. You can pair it with leggings, jeggings, dresses or kutis. So let's get started. This is a measurement I'm using. You can adjust it according to your requirement. Length 16 inches for high, 19 inches for low, bust 32 inches, waist 26 inches, shoulder 13.5 inches, front neck 9 inches and back neck 4.5 inches. These are the calculations we will need. Burst plus 2 inches of ease divided by 4. Waist plus 2 inches of ease divided by 4. So let's make the pattern. For pattern making we need paper, scale, markers, measuring tape and scissors. So this is the length of my shrub that is 19 inches. Firstly I'll mark all the vertical points on this line. Mark a point at 6.5 inches. This is the burst point. From this point go 7 inches downwards. This is a waist point. Now extend these points. Now I'll mark the burst and waist measurements. Burst is 8.5 inches as we calculated earlier. And the waist is 7.25 inches. Now join these points. Now I'll make shoulder and neckline. Shoulder is the half of shoulder measurement. In my measurement shoulder is 13.5 inches. So half of it is 6.75 inches. So make a point at 6.75 inches and mark the same point at the burst line too. Join these points. From this point go 1 inches inwards. Join these points. Now for shoulder, mark a point at 2.5 inches inwards. From this point, take the front neck depth that is 9 inches and mark a point. Again from this point, go 2.5 inches inwards. Now join these points. Now I'll make the front neck shape in this rectangle. I'm making curved V. So this is the front neckline. Front will cut in two pieces. Now from this point go half inches downwards. Join these points. Now I'll make the shoulder curve, front shoulder curve and back shoulder curve. Join it with dotted curve lines. This is the front shoulder. This is the back shoulder. Now for bottom, take the higher length of shrug that is 16 inches. Mark a point, extend this point. Now make a slant line of half inch on this line. Join these points. So the front pattern is ready. Now I'll make the back pattern. For back, take the higher length of the shrug that is 16 inches. Now I'll mark all the vertical points on this line. 
marker point at 6.5 inches for burst from this point go 7 inches downwards and make a waist po point extend these points now mark the wa uh, burst and waist measurements burst is 8.5 inches waist is 7.25 inches as we marked in front pattern join these points now for shoulder mark 6.75 inches and the same point on burst line too join these points Now for neckline, mark a point at 2.5 inches. From this point, uh, mark a depth of back neckline that is 4.5 inches. Again, from this point, go 2.5 inches inwards. Join these points. Now make the back neckline in this rectangle. I am making the round neck for back neckline. And make the back shoulder curve. From this point go half inches downwards and join these points. This is the shoulder slope. Now the back pattern is ready. Now I'll cut both the patterns. So the pattern is ready. Now this is the front. Front will cut in two pieces. This is the back pattern. This would be on on fold. So this is the short truck pattern thanks for watching hope you like the video don't forget to like share and subscribe i'll see you next time take care bye bye